Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So let's do Scorpio today. What are the extra messages for you, Scorpio? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, follow the Sun first. And also you can book a reading with me on WhatsApp or Instagram. Join me on Instagram if you want to see more offers and short readings which can resonate heavily with you. Let's see Scorpio was coming up. Scorpio, please. Scorpio, extra messages, please. For the rest of the month of August. Scorpio, what's coming up? Ten of Pentacles. I feel that you're growing. Okay, you're growing in general. You might be, some of you might be doing some business or something that might bring you more money. So focused on finances. Focused on your personal growth and a happy family life. So I feel that you're taking it slow steps towards success. It's not an immediate success, but you're, but the success is definite, okay? So page of wands, it's going to take time, um, but you're making a lot of efforts. You're focused. You're destined to be successful for some of you, for most of you. So yeah, there will be fruition in the end. Okay, so you're doing something creative or you're just being in your creative energy while doing your stuff, making money. The high priest, some of you are very, very intuitive. So you might know what is right for you, what is not right for you. So right now you might be deciding between certain things, okay, and uh, what you are trying to know, what best fits best for you, what doesn't fit best for you. So... Right now you are making the right decisions, going with your gut feeling, your intuition is on power. Some of you, this person you are dealing with in love is Aries, Sagittarius, Leo or a Pisces. Okay. Three of Pentacles. I feel that you are dealing with someone who is already having someone in their life. Queen of Cups. So, Scorpio, I feel someone you might be connected with the true work, okay, true financial relations you might be having with this person and they're interested in, in you, okay. For some of you, this is a third party. For some of you, this person is from your workplace and is interested in you and finds you a very nurturing and a, an emotional person, an overly emotional person. They see you as someone like that. Okay, Six of Swords, someone left your life, Scorpio. Or you might have left them and they're missing you, okay? So they're seeing you in their dreams and they're wondering oh, what if you guys were together like that. So you might have left someone or someone left you, okay? I feel you were in a difficult relationship in the past and you decided to leave. But this person still wants to work this out. Seven of Wands, I told you, this person still wants to work this out. You guys had a big fight, okay? Recently, there was a big fight, but this person really wants to work this out again. And uh, maybe you're dealing with someone who's a workaholic or who might have someone else who might have had someone else at the background because of which you had to leave because it made you hurt a lot, okay? It hurt you a lot, so you had to leave. But now this person is coming back. And making more efforts towards you because you are focused on yourself. That is the best thing. And this person wants to marry you. So if it's not the past person, then surely it's going to be a new person who's coming really, really fast. And it's going to give you that attention, that love you deserve. And yeah, um, time of celebration, time of marriage, time of commitment, uh, time of your personal growth is on peak. Scorpio, please. I feel that you're getting attention of more than one person for you. There is a strong, there's a strong energy of marriage. Okay, Scorpio, you're getting married very soon. Or someone is going to offer you a committed relationship, a long-term committed relationship turning into a marriage because you're making your own identity you know, by just being yourself. It's not like you have to do something and show this world this and that. You just have to be yourself. That's it. That makes your identity. And this person loves that. 
copy of these. Justice. So very strongly, I feel Scorpio getting married. And there is a high chance that you're going to reap the results of what you've sown in the past. So if you've done really good deeds in the past, you'll get exactly what you've done. Okay. So you'll get justice for your deeds and for your karma soon. And it's going to be in positive in your favor. So now is the time to actually reap the results or benefits from your past efforts all right so i feel that there is someone okay who has a strong crush on you okay and they might not open up to you in this month of august there is a chance someone is crushing over you but is not letting you know okay this person could be strongly libra gemini aquarius okay and aries sagittarius leo i feel that there are more people around you uh, more than one people if you're focusing on one there are more than one okay who are interested in you there's someone who's a air sign okay sun moon rising venus and they're interested in you physically like they have strong passion towards you for that special someone you mean the world to that person i feel that some of you scorpio are doing great okay are kind of getting famous or like that or being you know, doing something that involves global stuff, okay, world-related stuff, you know. So to each and every one, it will resonate accordingly. Two of Wands, I feel that you're looking for more options and you might also thinking to travel a different country. You might think to travel to a different country or expand your work to another country like that, okay. So it depends from person to person. So the wait is finally over and you're getting there. Whatever dreams you've had, you're actually making it work. Okay. So I feel that that is a decision that you need to make. Okay. And uh, it's about your work. It's about your money. It's about your finances. Maybe you'll have options and you need to decide which option you want to opt, which option you want to go for. Okay. So yeah. So I feel that you have more than one opportunities. I also feel that you you have more than one options in love as well. So yeah, there's a strong soulmate connection that's happening around you. So, so be open to that and lots of love coming in, Scorpio. Scorpio extra, please. Ooh, okay. Most of you getting engaged or getting into a communication with a person who will commit to you, okay? So you might be going to another level of commitment if you're already in a relationship. And if you're not, you're getting engaged or finding your soulmate. Wow, what better can get than this? Scorpio. Let me check. So this is a person that you deserved, okay? That your karma is bringing you, all right? So... Okay, calling in your soulmate. All right, wait. Some cards fell out, so I need to do this again. Okay. Healing family issues. I feel that there are some issues that you're facing right now. And every issue of yours is going to be healed after you meet this person. Because they're going to heal the most of you. Okay, They're going to help you heal the deep pores. The deep, sorry, the deep bruises you might be having. So yeah. I feel that you might be stuck on someone. But uh, don't be. Because there's someone better for you. That's coming towards you. Who's your soulmate. So this is a time for healing, a balsamic moon. So yeah, very soon you're going to heal yourself with this person, with this relationship. And very strong forever commitment coming up for my scorpions. Whoa. So just keep on doing whatever you're doing creatively for, for your personal growth, for your personal life. Whatever that you like, okay? Whatever. Not for others, for yourself. And I feel that you're excited about life and in general. You're excited about you, yourself, your body, your physique, your the way you look, 
you know, and you're you're very indulgent in self love. Okay, very very indulgent in self love. Some of you might be dealing with a Leo as well, or might come across one. Yeah. Okay, let, let me check the profession. For some of you, your partner's profession. I feel like you feel like um, you know, a little child who's enjoying the life, like. You feel a very fresh energy, okay? Light and love. This is... The person could be into tarot, maybe. Or just simply this person is also a psychic. Why did I say also? Okay. Anyways. This person is a healer, okay? Whoever you're going to deal with is a healer themselves. So this person is going to bring the healing touch to you, the light and love to you. This person will be according to your heart's desire, however you feel about, felt about this person. They will be the one for you, okay? Don't you worry about it. They're practicing something. They're into animals as well. They love animals. They can communicate with animals as well. So they're doing something that involves practice. So they might be polishing their uh, skills, okay? They might be doing some kind of internship. Yeah, so that's there for the reading scorpio i hope you have enjoyed this reading these were some extra messages and uh, don't forget to you know the drill like subscribe share this video hit the bell icon and mention in the comment section how this resonated with you Bye bye